Hey guys, in this video I want to talk about the easiest way to keep one card on top of the deck uh, using shuffles and this is the easiest uh, false shuffle that you can do is just retaining the top card. It's so easy. <laughs> so I'm going to show you the easiest ways to do that. Uh, without overcomplicating it um, because there are other false shuffles but they're intended for top stock or whole deck false shuffles and each one is progressively harder so you want to stick with these if you're just trying to control the top card because it's going to be the easiest and as I talked about in my last video don't run if you're not being chased you want to stick with the easiest ways to fool the audience without running too far ahead keep it simple so without further ado, my uh, favorite one is called the Slip Shuffle. And I did a previous video on that. Essentially all you're doing is just holding this card with your fingers while you do a regular overhand shuffle. And you're just going to retain that card like that. Check out my other video if you need more details. And that keeps that card on top of the deck. Very simple and easy. And very convincing at the same time because the cards are like face up and you're seeing them all mixed, it gives that illusion that everything is being mixed. When essentially it is, you just have one card that's not. Okay, this. I like it. The second method is going to be a riffle shuffle where you just keep the top card on top. Simple. And essentially all you're doing is this is the top half and this is the top card and you're going to shuffle and just make sure that that card always falls last. I got it. And, uh, and then you can always follow that up with the slip shuffle or whatever. Uh, some people even do just a simple false cut. I have a video I just made on those uh, easiest false cuts and the one I just did right there. Um, and so that's going to retain that top card. And uh, you can also do that on the table. The table riffle shuffle, same thing. You're just keeping that top card in place and a little tip is after you do it that way is to go the other way now so this is now the top stock here so it kind of gives that illusion when you go this way first and then you go back the other way it looks like uh, you're not keeping that top stock um, you could also do the overhand riffle shuffle face up if you wanted. You're just going to let, uh, since this is the top half, those cards fall first before you do it. So it looks like that. And that kind of gives a little illusion that all the cards are being mixed when they're not. So, guys, I hope this was helpful. As I said, uh, these are the easiest uh, false shuffles to do. And the reason being is you only need to uh, keep the top card in place. So don't try to overcomplicate it and do anything that's too uh, difficult, um, like a full deck fall shuffle, because you really don't need to in this case. So you can really give that convincing illusion that the whole deck is being shuffled and you're retaining that top card the entire time. So hopefully this was helpful, guys. Um, let me know, leave comments, and go ahead and subscribe, and check out the next video. All right, thanks.